This is so good, like seriously. Both the tour and the food and also the drink. Morning you guys, good morning from Cusco, Peru. We're still here, we've been here for a month or so already. I've been hopping around village to village to Machu Picchu, back to Cusco and Pisac. I've been enjoying it. This is actually my last day, but I actually really regret booking my flight to Chile and then to Brazil. Today, the last day, I'm taking the opportunity of the free walking tour of Cusco. First thing first, Cusco was not Cusco before, like before Spanish arrived. Cusco was Cusco in Quechua. Spanish just couldn't pronounce the word, so they changed it all. Cusco actually means the center, which is, yeah, the capital of the Inca. We are at the main square, which they actually call it Cusipata. Cusipata, Cusipata. Means the happy place in uh, Quechua, because before this, they used to use this place as a party place, all the thing, all the feasts going on. This is the Inca wall. But that is not the Inca wall. That's actually the Spanish one because if you can see, they have like the mortar in the in between. But that, the Inca wall, they got skill. No mortar, no nothing. They break the big rock and then put it in like um a little bit like a angle like this to survive the earthquake. One more secret in all this Inca wall, you can actually find a small little snake in some of the stone. They believe that snake is the symbol of knowledge. Some of the stone is like really huge, even bigger than my size. So there's still a mystery how they actually did it in the past. Like, how did they move it in? How did they build all this with, you know, it's not like straight line all the time. It's kind of like, no one knows. My love, come, don't be shy. Make a little llama come. <laughs> so during this free walking tour, the guide also take us to place to place where his friend work at or his friend owns it at the shop that we just stopped by. This is like one of the cheapest ones you could get like the alpaca scarf or alpaca blanket or whatever for like much cheaper. We also get a little bit of the, the freebie here. <laughs> This restaurant called Limbus. I have no idea this thing exists. This is such amazing view and all like the really tranquil vibes. Guys, in Lima, in Arequipa, in Trujillo, they use fish from the sea, right? Yes, because it has to be fresh. But we don't have a, a sea. We have to obtain the fish from the lakes and rivers. This is the reason why I am going to use trout. It's not salmon, yes. So this is salmon. No, it's trout. It's very fresh, clean, and orange. Of course, we need one lettuce, red onion, two different kinds of corn, the salt and pepper, lime juice. This is hot pepper, Tabasco, sweet potato. Fried sweet potato, camote, okay? Fried sweet potato. What is the tiger meal? My friends, the tiger meal is a mix of different kinds of chilies, so it's very spicy. But we have to add right here normal milk, cow milk, ginger, garlic, salt and pepper, and some coriander. I cannot give you the entire recipe because it's the secret of this restaurant, right? Yes, the chef is going to kill me if I give you the entire recipe, right here. So, I will put the fish right there. And guys, as you can notice, the fish is very fresh, orange, and clean. Cook the fish with salt and pepper and lime juice. I have to cook this. I have to add a lot, a lot of salt. I mean it, eh? I mean a lot. A lot of salt. And now goes the pepper, okay? Some pepper, lime juice. Like that is okay. That the fish is with salt and pepper and lime juice, okay? In a few minutes, you will notice that the color of the fish is going to change. It's going to get more and more white. 10 minutes, 15 minutes, or even 20 minutes. Meanwhile, I am going to give you this. You know what is pisco sour, right? The pisco sour is a mix of pisco, lime juice, sugar syrup, and a little bit of egg white. But guys, we have a popular way to say it in South America, eh? Yeah. Arriba, 
arriba, abajo, abajo, al centro, a centro, y adentro. 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 In this bar, you can buy a big glass of maracuya sour, you know. Of course, my friends, my friends, so the prices right here. At the beginning, it was orange. Now it's pink. Yeah. Of course, this is the chemical reaction of the lime juice. Like this is perfect, guys. A little bit. Like this. Yeah. All the tiger meat. But you know in Peru, we always say that if the ceviche is not spicy, it's because it's not a ceviche. It has to be spicy. Guys, this is spicy already, but I am going to add more because it's even more spicy. Now, it's a real ceviche. The red onions and the melon, like that. This corn is mote. This corn is boiled in water. You know, it's cooked, yeah. It's good, I like it. But my favorite snack is this one, guys. Canchita. And the canchita is toasted corn. It's salty corn, it's crunchy. Mote, canchita, red onions, lettuce. In the middle goes the fish. And guys, as you can notice right now, the fish is ready to eat. This is so good, like seriously, both the tour and the food and also the drink, he was a really good and passionate. We done for the tour and just for that little shot, as you can see, I got like super red already because of my Asian flesh and stuff. And then as I mentioned before that the tour, it's just um, tip based so you can just give whatever you feel like if the, you like the tour or something like that and then at the same time Woo! <laughs> yeah I liked it <laughs> I think right now we're just gonna have to go for food because we've been walking like so much up and down the hill and then like around the plaza and stuff <sighs> looking forward to it this is one of the places that the guy was recommending us before at the place called Chagruna native burger they have like all this uh, alpaca burger, which is something he recommends, and then they also have like a vegan burger with the quinoa and stuff. So I think we're gonna go for the alpaca one. I think I deserve it after all this walk for like hours. <laughs> Let's go. And then for the fries, they call it native fries, few types of potatoes mixed together as a fries. As you may know, like Peru is home for all the potato. The burger and I actually like this like type of meat more it come with the whole thing, not the patty. Because if you remember, we went to Oya de Tambo and all the apaga burger there is like a little bit like bushy and they already grind it and then mix it with some other thing. It's like too mushy and it's not I don't feel like I'm eating up on that no more, but this one, yeah. We're done for what's the name? So so hard to pronounce. Chakruna native burger, quite good, but I could actually like finish the whole thing. That means the portion is not that big. Really good burger place. And then the fry was just fresh cut. 
very nice. I think we're just gonna go for some like some more drinks or something. I'm looking for Inca Cola, but the one that is actually cold. I don't know why they sell it everywhere, but it's so hard to find it cold. Found it. Small one. I mean, cold one. Uh, oh. 50. Sí. Gracias. In Gagola. that we went today again I liked it a lot and then the guy that we got seems like he really know what he's talking about he really like passionate about what he's doing and he love his city he love his city's history so quite a few tour that doing something like this the one that we went with you see the guy quite blue there's some other like a free walking tour that you can just also find it on TripAdvisor or Google it in general. I chose this one specifically because a friend that I met in Pisac told me that oh you have to go with um with this blue t-shirt. Then it's tip baits, whatever you feel like, whatever you can afford it. One more thing. There's a one spot that the guy took us to. It's like it's the cross, the middle of Cusco and the middle of the Inca Empire. That is good to know because if I just like walk around in the city being dumb tourists, know nothing. I'm not gonna know at all like all the history behind this. So I totally recommend you guys check it out. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys in the actually in the next video. Bye.